good morning guys so today is friday and <laughs> interestingly enough we are in the middle of a hurricane or a tropical storm called no so we woke up today and it was just thunderstorm it was raining everywhere my plants are down <laughs> and um it's looking okay now like as you can see like it looks pretty bright outside but i think that we are in the eye of the storm right now so maybe we have more rain coming soon if you can see here it looks like it's just a rainy day but yeah i wish i had the footage but i just woke up to lots and lots of like a very strong thunderstorm so people are like rushing out now to get what they need to get before the storm gets worse but it's really nice it's chilly but i wanted to show you because i went on the website online to check what it looks like Woo! you see it's so windy anyway so this is the website that i was on to check out the forecast and you guys can see this is giving me an accurate view right now so da Nang, let me see if i can zoom in da Nang is right here and i mean i'm assuming that the eye will be somewhere here but it is slowly moving out right now so it's showing you the time 7 30 it's currently 9 a.m right now and you can see so the storm was actually supposed to hit the storm was supposed to hit uh this afternoon so around noon or tonight that was the plan so last night everybody was aware that we needed to go uh, shopping get all our stuff so i made sure to do that i got groceries i got my bananas and my goal this morning was to just cook some food just in case we were gonna have a power outage because you just don't know at this point um but yeah so it looks like it might be a positive news that this is almost done that's exciting anyway i'm gonna keep you guys posted because today Oh yeah, the roads are flooded. Oh, so my neighborhood doesn't seem like it's flooded right now, but apparently a lot of roads are already. Eee. That's something to be expected. But some news that we heard yesterday is that the they were going to evacuate about half a million people here that live by the beach because you know they expect to have flooding. They expect to have you know damages caused by the storm. So that was the plan yesterday. I don't know if they already did it and also they were going to kind of start like hurricane measures which is what they do here like they kind of free up the streets and they make sure that if there's any debris that it's going to go towards the ocean or towards the river so that you know nothing blocks the roads our street is a little bit slanted so if there's a lot of water it's going to go directly towards the river which is kind of good for us but yeah so we're just waiting it out <laughs> i do have a meeting i don't have that much going on today but i have a meeting around a 10 a.m so i already told everybody that i'm not sure if there's going to be a power outage so i'm just hoping that i'm able to do that but it looks like it's looking better like you can't tell right now it's like the storm is calm now but yeah i'm hoping that everything is calm and we can get back to normal i gotta tell you though it's so fresh outside the temperature is currently like 70 degrees right now so it's really nice and it's windy so i like that because we don't have to turn on the air conditioner ah, it's so windy <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> okay so the wind is coming I think it's so interesting when you're in the eye of the storm because you just feel like it's a nice breezy day. Ooh. And then Yeah. I'm gonna put my plant up again. That plant fell. Yeah. Okay, so before I have my call, let me make sure I make breakfast and prep lunch just in case the power goes out. So let's go.
Okay guys, so I just put some pumpkin to boil because I'm going to make some soup. So I have it right here. So it is boiling now. I added some celery. So I'm gonna let that boil and as it boils, I'm actually lower it a little bit. Um, I'm about to go have my call right now with uh, one of the Magic Ears recruiters. Let me just put that here. I'm gonna sit in Ralph's. I'm gonna sit in Ralph's chair. And I brought a little notebook just so I can answer some questions that I have about the hiring process because they did change it a little bit. So I want to make sure that I give you guys the right information. So I'm having a little chat with the recruiter. Um, so I wanted to take some notes. And once I'm done with the call, I'll give you guys more details about Magic Ears. Got my celery juice and apple. So let's get started. Because in the email, I know you guys said that you were focusing on North American accents, but you opened it to more countries. Hey guys, so I just finished the call with one of the Magic Ears team. I will make sure to make a video separately so I can just answer more of your questions. I basically asked her a lot of questions that I had uh, from you guys after my last video. So I'm going to make a separate video maybe in a couple of days to kind of answer those questions and give you guys more clarity on the application process. So look out for that video. But I'm actually looking at the forecast again today for the storm and it's currently 10.50 right now, but the forecast, let me double check if I can refresh it. So this is what the storm looks like right now. And if I do a live view, if this is 10.30 a.m. right now, this is where it is. So not that not not really much has changed. You can see the nang is right here. I think the whole this whole part must be the eye. If we have no, you know, outside is clear. I think that's what it means. Like we're in the eye right here, and this part, this is where we're going to get hit in like a couple of hours mm. because doesn't make sense. The eye is not that big. <laughs> I think the eye would be in the middle of the brown, the darker spots. Yeah, but we don't have. I wish I could get the actual satellite footage, like. That shows you real footage but we have no uh, actual storm outside it's actually clear so I'm thinking that when the red part hits the name yeah it's going to be thunderstorms again okay guys so here's breakfast I'm having some pumpkin soup just with a little bit of seasoning inside and these tomato basically toast so I have toast with a little bit of butter uh, parsley, garlic, and tomatoes on top. Yum! Hey guys, so it's a few hours later and <laughs> to tell you the truth, it looks like the storm is gone. I actually went on the website, I wanted to show you. So I'm on the website right now and it's showing you live view from 2 p.m. I'm gonna zoom in a little so you can see. We're out of the red zone. But it's been a while since we've seen rain. The Nang is right here. And look, I'm going to play the live footage. Yeah, it looks like we have nothing right now. It's almost done. And it's 2.20. It's not giving me the accurate time. It's giving me 2 p.m. It's 2.20 right now. And no big change. It looks like we don't even have that much rain. I'm gonna go outside to show you guys. So, 
you guys can see mm -hmm. the sky it's just cloudy but it's fine so i think we avoided this uh storm which is really cool at the end of the day 